Hi, my name's Thomas. I'm the festival director for Utopia this year. We're here in the park at Yukai, just outside the hall. It's Saturday morning and the Yukai Festival is in full swing with the primary schools doing their performances. Arts Collective got together and with a whole lot of the wonderful musicians in the area and the artists we put together a festival showcasing the visual art as well as having music obviously. This year in its fifth year it's really big we've introduced a whole range of craft workshops this year in our Arts in the Mountains program as well we've had a wonderful grant from Festivals Australia which has uh, allowed us to do a lot of bamboo installations around the site uh, games for kids as well as entrance ways and things like that. Uh, we also have a small Words of Wollumbin and spoken word component to the festival this year which is small but hopefully we'll be getting bigger and stronger as the festivals continue. The smell of wet earth is a memory deeper than time. I wait for rain again and imagine that single moment when the birds are silent. We started off with um, a couple of lines and then we've asked people to just add <coughs> onto it so we can create um, a community story. Oh look, my favourite piece at the moment is this one here actually. Uh, Vibrant Yukai by Heather McClellan. And I just really love the colour and the simplicity in it too. UKI's had a bit of a demographic shift over the last 10 years or so. Um, it's gone from being pretty much a farming community uh, based around the dairy industry uh, and now there's a whole lot of influx of people with families, young families and there's been a huge influx of creative people, musicians, uh, potters, fabric workers, artists and we all live either in or around the area but this festival gives the chance to really showcase that richness. We have such a wonderful community of artists and musicians and writers. I think it's really, really special. And the special thing about it is if you go over the hill to Mullumbimby, it's like $300 to attend their events, and here it's 35 It's much more village atmosphere and quality and cute. And there's so much talent in these hills, not only the Mullumbimby Hills, but also in the Yukon Hills, really. Oh, wow, you've got me in a bad time. These cakes are delicious. <laughs>